one. Hello again, everybody. Uh, Row 2501 here again. And uh, we're doing part two of our Sea of Thieves uh, tips video and getting started. Uh, once again, we do have my PUBG first person duos partner, Mr. Wizard, aka Booty Forecast. Uh, go ahead, man. How are we doing? Yeah, I'm Booty Forecast, aka Mr. Wizard. Um, booty as intended for loot, and that's. Just happens to be perfect here for Sea of Thieves. <laughs> I love it. Uh, well, nice. not initially. I guess we're going to go to, uh, we're going to do some souls first and actually and get some booty. And uh, just as another little helpful uh, tip or reminder, you know, you've just spawned into the game. You're coming back into it. Don't forget the barrels. These are all empty, it looks like. So I'll have to find some somewhere else. Oh, here we go. Cannonball. Yeah, balls. each time you jump back into the game, you do need to replenish your resources. Even if you, you won't need to do your it, it ship. It does not carry over from the last game. No. You won't need to do the ones on the ship because the ship will always spawn with full barrels. But you do need to replenish mm -hmm. the ones on your person. Yep. Good note. Empty, empty plank. Man, a lot of these barrels are empty. And because we have just spawned in, we're on like a, a random outpost. The game will assign you to, you know, whatever random outpost. It's not terribly important where it spawns you. It's just know that it does spawn you on an outpost. And um, that's when you spawn into the game they, new. It is important to know that they are not all created equal, though. No, some are bigger, smaller. Yeah. I haven't quite figured out if the names or the the different like uh, does the mermaid one differ from the oh crap in the water mm -mm. and I took damage but I'm next to the boat no I mean you're gonna you're you're still gonna have the uh, the same type of NPCs um, all of them are gonna be the same Tim uh, Cecile Stu and uh, all of them I imagine it'll come in like uh, like uh, in later game or in game it'll be like uh, I think they're gonna make new NPCs oh yeah. Most definitely. Like you'll have to go to a certain island to talk to a certain guy to get a certain quest type of thing. I guess. Most MMOs. Or if they introduce like a new rep uh, or a new faction, that faction may be uh, located on one specific island or one specific part of the map, but that's just speculation for later game. What we're going to do right now is just I'm I'm rearming up, so to speak, and then uh, we're going to go do an order of souls voyage, which is the hunting the pirate captains. I need to eat a banana. And in case you did see that, yes, I did eat the banana whole, which is the best way to eat a banana, apparently. Oh, of course. Of <laughs> you don't peel it. You don't do any of that. You just straight throw it in your mouth. Uh, see if these is hardcore apparently all right check i got everything let's go uh i'm gonna change yeah. my chest real quick. take your time if you remember from the last video we already had quests um and what you do when you get a quest whether you're on the galleon or the sloop uh you basically you find like the captain's table you'll see this proposed voyage here you just come there and the various crewmates can vote for, you know, either the souls, uh, gold hoarder, or merchant. So we'll load these cannons. All right, so uh, when we do make other Sea of Thieves videos that are just live commentaries and us screwing around, um, we're going to have like a, a running... A bet or timetable to see who hums Pirates of the Caribbean themes first, who starts talking like a pirate first, uh, who walks oh. the plank first, who ends up in the brig first, so on and so forth. We'll have a little tally going and let everyone know who's done what as they've gone along. Well, I'm not the I'm not the bearded lady, but I do have a mustache. Oh, sh check this out, dude. Ah, ha, ha, that's awesome. You look like a <laughs> female Mexican bandito. All you need is a sombrero. I really do, don't I? Yep. That's ridiculous. Oh, okay. this is hilarious. All right. Propose voyage. 
we're going to do one of these order of souls ones. It doesn't necessarily matter which one you do, uh, because they'll both practically have the same objective, find island, defeat waves, kill boss, grab loot, take back. And then you vote. Yep. And we're off. So once you do actually propose a voyage and it's uh, set forth, you see the screen, you know, gets those borders and tells you that you're on it. And then like Mr. Wizard has here, he's got the the little Uncle bounty. K. Yep. And as he just said, if you look at the bottom, last seen on, and I haven't seen it where the guy wasn't there already. Like, I, i.e., I didn't have to go to another island after finding a clue. That's only so far. Um, that could change later, you never know. Because um, it does uh, say yeah, last scene. These guys. Oh. Where are these guys? They're Tooth key. Yeah, they're a different one. And then, even though you he's holding it up towards me, one. you can hold the right bumper and, you know, look at him yourself. Here's the other one. Last scene on Shark Tooth Key. Now that we have both of these in our hands, even though we voted for, you know, the one particular voyage, once you do that, as you can see, both of the quests I had became available in the quest list. So right now, it doesn't matter which okay, one we go to. Okay, Barnacle K is on the way to Shark Tooth Key, so we can head to Shark Tooth Key and then make a turnaround and come back to Barnacle K, which is close to the outpost, or we can hit Barnacle K first, then go out to the key. I like your first suggestion better. We'll hit the far one first, Shark we'll hit the near one last, and then come back. turn in. It seems gotcha. like the most efficient uh, way to do it. All right, as you can well. see, he's on the map table. He's he's zoomed in with the right bumper. As we said in the last one, he's found all the islands. And uh, we've got a course. So let's uh, drop the sail, pull the anchor. Yeah, and... a little little east, a little northeast. But, uh, yeah. All right, a little northeast. Yeah. All right, here's the sail. So let me all know the way when down. Drop. Go ahead and do the anchor. If you both turn it, it goes much faster. If one turns it, obviously, it goes slower. And then we grab the wheel, and we're going northeast. Anchor up. Something I did forget to mention in the uh, sailing tips in the uh, first video, uh, I do apologize, is uh, you can technically do like uh, handbrake turns west. or e-brake turns uh, with your ship if Close. you drop the anchor. As you're moving, you'll turn abruptly in whatever direction you were turning in. I'm sorry, what was that again, Mr. Wizard? What direction? Post. Post. We want to kind of be like more on the north side of west. More on the north side of west. Oop, wrong way. Yeah, you're going east. Yep, I got it. I got it. There we go. As you can see, when perfect, I'm steering, perfect, perfect. Right, the Coming. compass, you know, tells you it moves with your direction, obviously. So you can see it. Your hand gets in the way every now and then, but it's never that big a deal. You just gotta constantly correct. Uh, just keep an eye on the wind for me, and then turn the sail if need be. Gotcha. The cannons are already loaded. Uh, there were two uh, helpful hints while I was looking for the uh, the guns to see if they were, uh, you know, cosmetic only and stuff like that. Uh, two tips. One, when you're traveling at night, if you don't want to be spotted, if you look on the front of the ship, there's those lanterns. You can actually douse Perfect. those so people... Uh, won't see you in the distance because they, they will be able to see you with the spyglass. Uh, the second one, uh, apparently, if you shoot your, your gun in the air, whether it's the pistol, the sniper, or the blunderbuss, uh, apparently it acts like a flare and people will be able to spot you on your portion of the island. It's just on the other side of this rock. All right. Uh, left or right? Uh, you can go left or right around it. It doesn't matter. All right. So one thing that I'm bad with or bad at 
is parking the boat close enough to the island so that you don't have to swim a long way, uh, you know, because, you know, pirate game, sea, island. Dark bound. They, they, all have sa- they all have sand barges, which is, you know, where the sand comes up to its shallowest area. And, uh, you know, if you hit it, you'll crash and put a hole in your ship and then sink if you don't do anything about it. Uh, I'm notoriously bad at knowing how close to get. So I... Slam that east. East. I forgot to look at the shape of the island before I... Another helpful tip, be sure to look at the shape of the island so you know what you're looking for. We good? I mean, it's weird. Yeah, we're good. All right. That's perfect right there. Another thing you'll notice as you're driving, whether you're solo or uh, in a multi-crew voyage when you're steering, you'll actually feel the controller vibrate just a tiny bit when you're actually straight on when you're going straight whether you're you know slightly to the left or right of anyone let you know you're going straight for a change as opposed to you know turning slightly one way or another i was i thought that was a nice change to like uh, help you denote exactly when you're going straight okay you see this island to our right with the rocks with the palm tree yeah okay it's in so it's a little bit past there okay i see it And something I have noticed, at least, you know, for these early hunts, um, a lot of the islands where you end up hunting these guys are really tiny. They're not on the bigger islands, or at least not yet. And since it's a smaller island, I'm going to try to get in closer. Get ready to drop the anchor, Mr. Wizard. Yeah, because there's, there's a team right there. Shit balls. So they might be on the other island. All right, sail up. Drop the anchor. Drop it, drop it, drop it. All right, looks like we made it. We didn't hit the sandbar. Let's go, some skeletons! And they're already out waiting for us. Three hits, takes down a skeleton, uh, whether it has a gun or a sword. Uh, the ones with the blue headband that you saw me kill just a second ago, those ones go down in three hits. Bosses, totally different story. More over here. Yep. And uh, you fight them in waves. Uh, one wave won't start until you've killed all of the skellies from the first wave, or the previous wave. You saw that guy had a sword hit me. <clears throat> Something else that I've noticed uh, in doing these pirate voyages, or these uh, boss voyages, the, the skeletons without, uh, without weapons, they will run from you after you hit them once or twice. So then you got to go in this skeleton chase quick for being, you know, all bones and no ligaments. Yeah, that is true. Oh, here that here's Captain Kate. Yep. And there's two of them. He's got, they've got guns. Oh no, Katie's oh, on shit. the I got to heal. Island. I got to heal. Yeah, go ahead. I got this. All right. Give me a second. All right. I'm coming back. Yeah, I got a blunderbuss too. I kept mine. And uh, if you're unfamiliar with super old weapons from this era, a blunderbuss is technically like an old-timey shotgun. A shotgun. Yep. All right. Oh, don't shoot me. There's friendly fire. Down he goes. So every time you kill a skeleton boss, whether you're by yourself, there's one or two, you always have to pick up just a moment ago. You'll literally Oh, I grab... didn't pick up the other one. Okay, you'll literally grab the skull of the enemy, over here. and that's what you turn into the Order of Souls. This is the item that other players can plunder from you. Let's see, bananas. Drop that okay, so um, I found out that drop is different than disengage. I always hit B. It, it always did the same thing for me. It won't, it won't let me assign both to it for some reason. Huh. I gotta check that in a second. I, so my disengage is different from mine. I'm gonna put right. them up here, dude. Business. Yeah, I'm just plopping it down here. So uh, you can put these anywhere, just as long as they're on your ship, so you can get them back. Um, 
you can put them down in the hole, doesn't matter. Um, if you want to be a little sneaky, you can climb way up in the crow's nest and plop them up there. Uh, mind you, you'll probably only get a couple of chests, maybe one, if you decide to put chests <laughs> up there. But those skulls, you should be able to put a uh, decent amount of those there. Um, something I, I did forget. You on this island. And I did forget to mention. I apologize. In the uh, part one video, when you're in your ship, whether you're in the galleon or the sloop, you'll find the little boxes where you can change your clothes, grab bananas, can change your equipment, everything. And they're usually all marked with a sign, of course. See, food is banana, wood plank, hammer, boot. And then here's Grog, and uh, we haven't done it yet, but if you drink too much yeah, in this game, you, your pirate will get wobbly, move on his own, and eventually get sick and throw up. And yes, you That's can throw really? up on your other crewmates and blind them. I don't have a cup. Uh, you should. Uh, left bumper into your inventory. You should see it. Oh yeah, my extra inventory. Alright, so we're going to the next island. I dropped the sail. Picking up the anchor, and we're up. taking off. Hey. Celebrate with some grog. What's the name of the next island? Or where's the next island, I should say? Barnacle K. Uh, just flip a U around this island. Alright. Flipping a U. That's the technical pirate term, by the way, flipping a U. As I stated earlier, uh, when oh, I made the D&D &D comment in the gold like... cutlet... Oh, go ahead. Oh, wow. Hold on. This is crazy. I only drank one cup of grog. grog. I can't even read the map. I can't move. Uh, ah, that's hilarious. My, my legs are gone. All right, hold on. I'll, have, I'll do it. They're still gone. Oh, that was a mistake. I'm not drinking no more grog. forgot to look. Uh, I've got to turn more south, straight south. So yeah, if you're doing a solo voyage, you'll end up doing what I just did a moment ago a whole bunch of times, going back and forth to the map, to the wheel. And thankfully, as you saw, they're quite close and together. And you're perfect right now. All right, cool. You're right there, good. Yeah, we can just sit straight and we're good. Super sweet. It's going to be a little sweet. bit sore less, but it's, that's fine. Oh, right on. Uh, super sweet is also uh, correct pirate lingo, in case you're wondering. But yeah, uh, because I am uh, a super nerd, remember how I mentioned the D&D &D gold cutlass, gold sword thing? Um, as we are playing this, making these videos, I am watching Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> so technically, I've already checked off one of the markers, watch Pirates of the Caribbean, while playing the pirate game. Whoop. If you'll notice, just a moment ago, I was pointing southeast instead of straight bit ago, and that's just because, you know, ship physics, you'll drift as you sail. That's, you know, like real life for the most part. How close are we? And because the seas are really rough, it does take quite a while to correct yourself in the direction you need to go in. Personally, I think these water physics are fantastic. Like, seriously, best water physics in gaming. Whoops. Which way? Mr. Wizard, can you hear me? 
Oh, am I muted? Oh, I'm muting myself. My bad. Yeah, <laughs> just go right. Yeah, that's that's the island right there, directly ahead. The one with the big, uh, the big the mountain over on there. Top. All right. Yep. Can you give me some sail? Uh, angle me. Yeah. Left, right. Look up. Look for the wisps. They'll tell you which direction the wind is blowing. The sail should make a nice whooshing sound when you hit it. It did. Alright, cool. Yeah, I heard it. Oh, right. yeah, we picked up big time. Oh, yeah. Let's see how close we can get to the island without crashing. Take the wheel for a moment. I'm going to go make sure we're not sinking because of the rough seas. All right. I'll drop the anchor. Just let me know when. All right. So even though the seas are rough, like I said a moment ago, I came down here to make sure we don't have any holes because your ship will get holes in it if you're in seas too rough. Found that out the hard way when I was playing uh, by myself the other day. Oh, we went to the outpost, my bad. Oh, it's fine, dude. We'll just we turn in it. what we got. Crap. I'm about to hit this island. Uh, turn, turn, turn. Shit, sail. Yeah, I'm turning. Up, up. I'm gonna, yeah. I'm... Anchor, right, go ahead and drop the anchor. Yep, drop that anchor. Boom. Oh, we're gonna handbrake turn into the island. Good turn. Right. Way to go. I got it. And there's how you don't start crash it. I'm starting the island. Uh, come back, you forgot a skull. Oh, yeah. yeah that's right. I always do that, dude. Like, I'm like, outpost, everybody off the boat. Oh, crap, I gotta go back and get the skull. Yeah, I wanna run all the way back. And so we're looking for the eye, which is order of soul. Because that's the quest we did. Here we go. I. Yeah, it should be right here. And then you come here and just X to sell. $217. Oh, you passed it. It's right here. Oh, I Turn glitched. Around. Wrong way. Oh, crap. How far did I glitch? Oh, that was weird. Yeah, you teleported a jump. As you can see, he turned his in. I got bounty for it as well. He got bounty for the one I turned in. You basically, whether it's gold hoarder, merchant, or orders, uh, order of souls, everybody gets rep, everybody gets gold for the turn ins. Yeah, I'm almost five on the order of souls. I'm hold on, level seven. I'm almost eight. Nice. All right, so now that we've done an order of soul, um, let's cancel the one we're on. And uh, do you have any gold hoarder ones? Um, you know what? I think I have. Yeah, I have gold hoarder ones. Okay. So all you have to do is come over to the table to cancel whatever your current voyage is if you want to change to something else. Well, let's go. Let's. Oof. I mean, we're right here by that island. We can go get that, and then we can we can turn um, put my voyage on. And then go do that. Um, all right, look, come over here and then no vote this uh, cancel here. All right. It wouldn't there. let me no vote. Yeah, yeah. Boom. All right. We don't have to go back and kill those other ones, do we? Um, on actually, it, there are two uh, different ones. It changes, which is one yep, thing I'm glad changed. we just did a moment ago. So even though I just had a voyage that said we needed to go to an island that was really close to us, since we canceled it, it basically like reset the quest for you, and it changed it to go to different places now. So it is random. I do like that. Yep, I like that. That's too. a nice little element to the game. Yeah, I noticed that the other day because I uh, accidentally. I, I wanted to pick one captain over the other, and that's when I noticed that you get both, but also if you cancel it, 
it regenerates uh, new ones completely. Okay. So, well, then uh, I guess let's do the gold hoarders one. All right. Real quick. I'll propose one. Vote to cancel. I guess you got to give it a second to cancel. Now we got a gold holder. Whoops. It, that X is where we need to go. So, yeah, these obviously are different. When you look at the paper, it's a map with the X where you're supposed to dig. So we need to find this odd shaped island. And then we need to go to that X. There's nothing on the back. So now we just have to go shape hunting. It almost looks like a heart, doesn't it? Yeah, it's it's a weird shape. Oh, Bone I think that's cove, it. Does that look like it? Nope, nope, that's not it. There's a dip in the top. That's not... Like if there's a chunk missing out of the head or something. Okay. Uh, what where are the coordinates? Uh. Well, it has coordinates on the map for like where the treasure is, but it doesn't have coordinates on the overall map where to well, go. I mean, like, is it is it is it by like W eight or? Oh, uh, D E. And then go down. Okay, with D E what? Uh, shit. The next closest one would be three four. Much? No. Thunder Valley. Uh, no, you're. E, go down. Okay, that didn't work. Nope. That's more like a pork chop. Uh, zoom in a little more. You're, you're probably not seeing all the... Thunder chop? Nope. Uh, hold on. Go down a tiny bit. Check that paradise. Up a tiny bit. Uh, Paradise Springs. Check that one real quick. No, 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 down. Oh shit! You know what? It's Barnacle Bay. Is it Zoom really? in. Zoom in. It is Barnacle Bay. That's ridiculous. Uh, the the <laughs> island where <laughs> we had the skeleton bosses is now the island where we have to go for the treasure hunt. That's good. That is hilarious. That's great. All right. Uh, let us bust the UE and go to Barnacle Bay. So we got to go there anyway. All right, are these cannons loaded? Yes, they are. See the wick sticking out, wick sticking out. All right, I'll grab this anchor. Cells down. You want to grab the wheel? Yeah. All right, turn straight I can around. Dive real quick. Yeah, whatever direction you were facing, go the opposite. I.e., north, south, east, west, so on and so forth. Got to make sure I got bullets. Yep. I should be facing it now. All right, give me a second. I want to show the people's the other guns. Uh, no, no, no. Turn back to the north. Go northwest. You went, like, completely around the island. Okay, facing northwest. Keep going. Just a little bit more. A little more north. All right, you're good. You're good. You're pointing right at okay. it. I'm already, ca I'm already countering. All right. And you'll feel that little shake when you're going straight. But yeah, it's that tiny island straight ahead. You see it? That little mound right next to that big-ass spire. Oop, got to turn the sail a bit. So the tiny, a tiny island by the spire? Yeah. Oh, 
which way is it blowing? Oh, it's blowing the I other way. It's there it goes. Whoosh. There it goes. I think we're going to land on the side where the treasure chest is. That would be great. I really do enjoy this game. It's Yeah, it's, it's fantastic. So we need to be on the side of the island that's like uh, whole, not the side that has the divot taken out of it. Oh, and pro tip for you guys. Um, when you see other pirates, not all pirates are enemies. I mean, you could probably make friends with them and be able to join forces to help each other and have like a fleet, a real crew. Yeah. Something to look forward to. Let's build the community, not break it down. Exactly. Good, uh, good point, dude. Uh, turn more to your northwest if you want to go on the side where the treasure is. Okay, how's that? Uh, no, more to the west. All right. And then just straight now to the island. Watch out, because I think there's a rock in front of you. I can't see. Crap. Go more to your... There we go. Oh, I yeah. think we're good. A little bit to the uh, starboard or right. Yes. All right, straight now. All right, I'm going to get sail. Drop the anchor. Drop that anchor. Turn, turn. And poof. Awesome. All right, let's grab a shovel and start a digging. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna kill people while you do. All right. There's already people on the island. Uh, there's skellies over there. All right, the big rock is next to the little rock. I know that sounds nowhere near comprehensive. Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! I know what I'm doing. Oh, I'm out of the cannonballs. I wonder. Oh, up. Totally right, dead. Uh, All right. It should be over here. Rock a little rocket right here. Yeah, it should be right here somewhere. Oops. Where's the exit? Um. Poor Mister. Poor sense of direction here. Oh, here I know how to find it. Big rock, little rock. Oh, skellies. I found it. All right, awesome. Is there more than one? Oh, this dude, a different skeleton type. This one had a hook on his hand. That's cool. I've never seen that. Usually they all had hands. I'm taking this back to the ship. Yep, I'm coming. This chest sucked. There was just a normal chest. Yeah, it's a basic little... All right, and the map is gone. When it's completed, you'll no longer see the little map to go get it. So we'll go turn this in, and we'll grab a merchant one and uh, finish out. Yeah, the 
So that uh, outpost is directly behind us. Yep, just uh, turn to the south. Okay, keep going. Keep going. Oh, yep. Keep going. There it is. I see it. Right there. You got it. I'm going to go around these big rocks. Oh, no. Actually, I'll go between them. There's plenty of room. Oh, shit. There's a storm coming. So, as I said in the uh, part one sailing tips, this is where we have to be careful of the holes from the storm. If the seas get too rough, you'll spring a leak. Yeah, you got some balls right now. Yeah, I got it. I've done this before. To be a pirate captain, you've got to take pirate chances. See if I can Kay. put this close to the island without crashing. Put up the sail. Yep. Okay. Tell him when to drop. Oh, we're going a bit slow now, so no rush. Yeah, there's no reason to rush. We're good. Alright, drop it if you want. got the chest, didn't you? Oh, you know what? <laughs> I, I hit. I heard you hit the water. You might as well got it since you... Like I said, dude, every single time, <laughs> I've always forgotten. I, I don't it. even think about the chest. It's like Me the neither. whole point of leaving. I just jump <laughs> out. It's the whole game, and it's the most important thing that I, I leave behind. Yeah. My World of Warcraft brain is like, just go turn in the quest. Not go turn in the item. Do every game, really. Nope. Alright, where's the gold hoarder do you dad? Oh, he's over here, he's in the little tent. Oh, he's right here. Hundred dollars. Yeah, cool. Or a hundred gold. Or a hundred pieces of eight if you want to be super accurate. Alright, I think the merchant guys are over here. He's over here by the ship lady, my suit. Alright. Grab whatever. And rearm up the got Mildred. Don't forget to grab bullets when you get back on the boat. Actually, I'm full up. I don't need nothing. I already had a merchant one. Okay. Um, Where do we get the traps from? That's the ammo. only thing that I don't... You have to you have to find them on the islands. Okay, it's they're the on the way. islands. I thought they were next on to the islands. merchant guys. That was the only thing I did not. Nope. Thank you, sir. Nope, they are on the islands. You just have to kind of luck and hit them. All right. And this is the what we're going to do now. We're doing the last faction, which is the merchant traders. And typically, these quests are uh, go to an island, pick up some animals or spices or whatever. And then bring it back like I can get like ammo from the, the probe, right? Uh, there's ammo. It's on the ship. 
Um, the bullets for the gun are on the ship. The cannonballs are in the barrels. As far as I know, that's the only place to get bullets is on the ship. Okay, I thought I figured you can get some from the pub. You might be able to. I just hadn't looked to know if it was or wasn't there. Good thing to gotcha. check when we uh, turn this other one in. Sail down. Cannon loaded, cannon loaded. All right, propose the voyage. Let's do Mr. Aang. All right, what do we gotta do? We need to grab a white feathered chicken. And yes, there will literally be a black and a white chicken on the island. Um, the only major difference for the merchant quests as opposed to the other two is you do have a time limit. Have to be done by 3 a.m. on the 12th. Um, where do we find the day yeah, time? Um, limit? Yeah. In the game. Who's calling that one? Uh... It has plunder outposts, so it's going to be pretty far. We need to go somewhere near plunder posts. Um, do you think, think Thieves Haven might have it? What? The... Ages, plunder. black and white chicken. Uh, yeah, let's just hit the nearest island and see what we got, dude. This is okay, this plunder, plunder outpost. Is that where we are on plunder outpost? No, 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 we're not. That's where I picked that, that mission from. Okay, that's where you got it from. Yeah. Uh, let's just go to, oh, Crow's, oh, no, not Crow's Nest. Uh, Devil's Ridge? It's fairly Devil's big Ridge? Island. Yeah, Devil's Ridge. Wow. Let's do it. So that's... Oh, um, I forgot to mention uh, in part one video again, I'm sorry. When you want to put a mark on the map, you just hit A. If you want to unmark it, just go back to it, hit A again. Uh, we just got to go straight south. I'll turn the sails once you get south. Heading south. Oh, got an achievement. Yeah, I unlocked like three or four achievements while we're. I've already got like, I think six. That's probably my seventh or eighth one. You get them fairly easy. Ubisoft is having a spring sale right now. Uh oh, I might go see what they got. Yeah, uh, siege might be cheap. I do want to play that. Like, I've been seeing lots of videos. It does look like our kind of game, especially since we pub a lot of G. Dude, I've, I've played a lot of it on PC and by far, like, one of my favorite games, hands down. Uh, Star Probably my favorite 2016. Really? Drop, yeah. I think it was my favorite game in 2016. It's crazy to think that it, or to, you know, it's that old. Yeah, it's already two years old. I mean, it's in its third year right that. Yeah, they just dropped a new operators pack out a month and a half ago, two months yeah, ago. Yeah, there's like a zombie operation going for March, like uh, in a few days. Yep. Is this the island right here? Yeah, this is, yeah, it's this this right is Devil's Ridge. Alright, right, this part right here is over lower, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to swing it right all the way around. Yeah, alright. I was just going to say, because it's a bigger island, the sandbar might be further out. Yeah, I gotcha. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The fucking sandbar is way out there. Uh, you want me to drop it? Uh, get ready. I'm going to go right on this 
right. next to this rock. Sail up. Turn outward drop, so that drop, we're facing drop. outward. Drop. There you go. Sweet, dude. Good piloting. Or good boating or whatever it's called. Captaining. I'm starting to get better. I'm starting to get a little bit better. I was kind of worried about the getting used to the mechanics of the boat. You're going towards the snake. Be careful. Yeah. All right. Look, there's a pig. So there are animals here. We just got to find the right animal. What the crap yeah. is that? There are little hints. I don't know what these are for because there's some places where you can start fires at, but I don't know how to start a fire. Uh, shoot something. All right, so I far a lot of pigs. Really work. Oh, we need to find cages first. I'm looking for both. Oh, dude, uh, message in a bottle. Th Here, these are yes, exactly what I was yes. talking about in part one. Messages in a bottle. Holy Boom. cow! Map discovered. Treasure chest, two chests on this island. That's this island, right? Is, no, this is a Devil's Ridge. This is not. This is a different island. We'd have to go back to the ship to yeah, look. This is way. Yeah. But back to our mission. Oh, I think I see a cage. Uh, nope, that's an exploding powder. barrel. So, something we haven't seen yet. These barrels, you can pick them up and put them on enemy ships and blow them up. And you can actually pull a Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah, I don't want it. I, I yeah, usually just... put them on our ship, but that risks our. A chance of yeah, I, Oh, you uh, ran just right by us. I know. Holy I heard God. him right as I passed him. I was like, oh. There are nothing but pigs on this island, dude. I think we need to go to a different Yeah, island. I we I think we do. This is Pig Island, it looks like. But before we take off, we need to check the shape of the island. Yeah, and well, I'm also seeing if there might be a cage. Yeah. I'm still crap. That, it, that was a snake. If I was a little bit closer, I would have got bitten. Uh, I was going to say, did you, walk, you almost walk off the edge? Yeah. I mean, I would have died. Nothing but barrels. That's all, all right. I see is barrels. Get the uh, M and F out of here. There's a cave around here somewhere. I know for sure. Here it is. I found it. Oh, there's nowhere to jump off the top. We gotta walk down. Oh yeah, I see the cave too. Yeah, but it's, it's just an overpass. All right, that's fine. Head down, back to the ship. There's like a a fine line between being off your ship. And getting back on it as quickly as possible because you know people think it so be aware of that oh within a matter of minutes yeah yeah if uh if you're on an island try to do what you got to do as quickly as possible because yeah it was pig city i didn't see any i, saw, I didn't see nothing i didn't see anything either at least we got the message in a bottle All right, I'm headed back. Yeah, I'm already on the ship. I was checking real quick to see if there were like another message in a bottle or anything. Oh, man, I really wish that they they had a cage. That's gonna be the hard part. Oh, I got one. What? Hooray for checking the island one last time. There are a shitload oh, of snakes on this gosh. side of the island. Good lord. Um, the only one, though, that. Tempted to grab one of these pigs just to see if we can turn it in. Yeah. Our roommate is playing some good music right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm watching another movie. Um. Yeah, we'll find cages on the island, the next one, or wherever we go. Uh, find the next nearest one, and we'll just go to that. We'll island hop like... Eaves. Hell, we can just... 
put that there. I think that's the island that... Oh, yeah, let me look at that map real quick. As you can see, like, what I did was I turned the wheel a little bit so that when we raise the anchor, we won't run into that rock that's over there to our left. And maybe we should have broke this one up into two part or a third part. Didn't realize we were getting long in the tooth. Yeah. Oh, well. I think it's Cannon Cove. Alright. Uh, which way am I going? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Uh, Someone go... shooting. Oh, crap. Someone yep, hit us. Hold on. Something hit us. It's Islander shooting at us. Patch the hole. I'm, pa I'm patching right now. Alright. Uh, hold on. I'm coming to you so I can show the people. Uh. Oh, oh well. See the hole right over here. Oh. oh, there it is. See? And what he was doing was... He oh, bail, bail! Bucket. <laughs> Your one scoop got all of it. Yep. Now I gotta get back on the That's wheel. That. Oh, oh, yeah, dude, you're that about was to just in time. The island. We turned a 360, literally. We went right back towards the island. Okay. They're shooting at us again. Yeah, just stay go. Yeah, stay there. You're gonna have to patch again. Okay, now take a left. Keep going left. Yeah, yeah, I see it. It's right in front of me. Uh, well, that's not the island, but oh, we can go there. No, no, no. Where's the treasure? That's where we need to go because we got the message in a bottle. I th it's Crook's Hollow. Go okay. left. Left. Okay, counter steer right there is perfect. All right. Okay, we're gonna pass a small keyhole island. Mm-hmm. That's right in front of us. It's right after that. All right. You want to stop to see if there's chickens? Okay. So, um, that's your choice. You see the one right there with the flag on top? Hold on, I'm Straight ahead. resting a wave. Yes, I see it. Um, Is that an outpost? That's, or? that's the uh, that's the fortress. It's after that. Okay. It's after that island. Yeah, let's stop on the fortress and see what we can. I mean, we can just do a drive by or a sail by or whatever it's called, a float by. Fair enough. Yeah, do let me know in the comments if, if you do like the shorter videos or the longer ones. Can't seem to get that cell right. I was that just a moment ago when I was doing I think it's against us, that's why. It's, uh... My old eyes can't really... Couldn't focus on the direction. Yeah, it's fine. It's falling against us. Spyglass it, see if you see any chickens. Don't see any chickens. Alright. We'll pass it then. A uh, tip about these forts right here, if you do happen to just go to one, if you look around, uh, you should be able to find a captain's chest somewhere. Which is like uh, just extra loot that you can turn into the uh, gold hoarder guys, and they're usually fairly valuable. Uh, there's yeah. a pirate ship to our starboard. 
They just got left from there. Yeah. See if they, uh, you may want to go mana cannon just in case. Gotcha. Yeah, we're heading in the right direction. Yeah. I'm going to go with the uh, don't shoot at me and I won't shoot at you philosophy. But the joke's on them because they're not getting anything from us because we have nothing to get. I mean, my pride's still on the line. Oh, yeah, but at least we don't have to worry about losing our loot. Yeah, that's true. And they can waste their time and resources. Uh, they're going to the outpost. Yeah, it looks like they're turning away from us. Yeah. Nearing land. Yeah, these are crazy rough seas. Yeah, they are. I have to do a ton of steering just to stay in my bearing. Well, that wind's blowing against us, too. Doesn't help at all. Um. Uh, you want to go for the low chest? I'll go for the high one. Don't forget you can lunge. You remember that? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, left bumper attack, I believe. Uh, get ready to raise the yep. sail. And drop the anchor. Uh, drop the anchor. Drop the anchor. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. We're good. We're good. Boom. Pretty sure I'm pointing at an outpost. Let me double check. Okay. Now, where we are, there is a chest directly to the right of us. Uh, nope, we're pointing at a fort. We gotta bust a UE if we want to, uh... Well, there's two. There's two. Yeah, I'm gonna go for the one that's up top. Okay. Because there's, there's one, like, on the... I don't know, the... Uh, I'm going for the one that's by F3. Okay, I see. Are you gonna Are you gonna drive over there? No, nah, oh, fuck, I'll run. Okay. Uh, oh, there's chicken. Out. There's chicken here. Where? Did you get the cage? No, crap. Right in front of us. Yep, yep. I'm going back for it. Okay, I'm not gonna dig or anything so I don't scare him. Yeah, yeah. These things here. Uh, there's a chest right here just sticking out of the ground. I picked it up. Oh. That was ridiculous. It was literally sitting on the beach. I think I found I've another cage. I've never seen that before. Uh, grab one of the chickens. How do I grab a chicken? Uh, I believe you just walk up to it and you'll see the X to... It'll prompt you for X to catch him. I imagine you gotta be right on top of him, though. Alright, I'm right behind you. We need a white and a black. Uh oh, phone call. Uh, uh, it's not picking it up. How do you do this? Oh, maybe we have to run him into it. Hold on. Ah, oh, Skelly. I mean, he ran right into it. Oh, this is a pig crate. We don't have a chicken crate. Oh crap! I didn't realize they were. All right, cool. Everything's learning process. All right, so well, I there found you go, people. One. You need to. You need specific. Uh, oh crap! Lantern. 
You need specific uh, crates for specific animals. Okay, so that... Um, Whoa, what the... Oh, crap, there's a that snake. That chest is around here. Hold on. A snake right here in front of me. Oh, dude. Oh, I still hit him. Oh, he got me. He got me. Got me, too. Oh, he spit. That's why. So this is what poisoning looks like. Your screen turns purple and it gets all flashy. Just uh, eat a banana and you should be fine. Okay, so... Okay. Skelly! It's outside. Wherever right. that thing is, it's outside. Alright, I'm going for the F one. Alright. Keep an eye out for cages. Where am I? Okay, I should be... Aha, I think I know where I'm at. Mr. Poor Sense of Direction here. Found it. Okay, I know where I'm at. I've got to turn around and go this way. Oh, dude, there's another chest right here. Holy crap. I can't even complete my regular mission because I keep finding crap. Seriously. I found another fucking just world chest. Bro, why are you running? This is where it gets kind of... Uh, dangerous, I guess you could say, because, you know, we're, we're looting up, and, uh, this is all the stuff that people can steal. Okay, so we got three chests all together right now? Uh, we're gonna have four by the time this is all said and done. Yeah, maybe, maybe more. Yeah, if I keep randomly finding them like that, I didn't know they were. Yeah, there's just random ones sticking out. But then again, like, you can also uh, go to shrines and find them too. Yeah, like uh, the bigger islands, I never, I didn't usually go to them because uh, my uh, border of souls were always really close, and they were on small islands. So, we're going to grab the map again. Uh, whoosh. All right, so we're over here by the little two uh, if you, uh, B5, C5. That's where we're at now. We've got to get all the way across the map to the F, so we're going to run through the cave and go back this way. Go back the way we went last time? No, this way is shorter. Oh, you went around the other way, okay. Yeah. See if you can find a cage while I'm going to get that treasure. There's a cage. There's a cave. Yeah, I'm right in front of it. Well, there's another cave over here. Dude, there's all kinds of markings. Yeah, I'm just going to look for cages real quick. No. Alright, now I'm back to where I was when I found the other chest. Oh, dude, I heard some, like, ghost noise. Yeah, I hear some, too, in this cave that I'm in. I never heard that before. I think I'm where I need to be. Not 100% sure. Do you hear a lady? I hear something. Dude, bro, I swear I'm not tripping, dude. I heard a girl screaming. Yeah, dude, something's like that wailing. so bizarre. Yeah, I hear that. 
I'm sniping a snake. Just because I can't. Okay. Uh, so if you look, all the sniper rifles are like this as far as I know. The cracks that meet in the middle, that's your center reticle. Man, that snake took three bullets. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm way on the other side. Good lord, those t snakes can take some damage. Okay, uh, two rocks. I think I was right next to him. By a waterfall. Uh, here we go. Can you dig on ground? Or is it only... Okay. I think I'm by it. I'm not 100% sure. I think I'm by it too. Quite terrible at digging for these things. Yeah, I think it's by I mean, like five. I think so. I'm judging by how many snakes are here, it's around yeah, it's, this one. I'm pretty sure it's this rock oh, pile, dude, yeah. like right here. Right, right here. Okay, maybe not. So as you can see, these uh, treasure hunting and uh, merchant quests take quite a bit longer than hunting skelly captains. Which is why I said that that would be the most efficient way to do your solos, is hunting skellies. Does it mean this rock up here? I, they wouldn't be so close to this cave, though. That's the thing. Let's see. Oh, duh. Compass. I'm facing south. Only problem I think we're on the wrong side of the island. I think I'm on F5, which means you're right. We need to go... We need to go north. Which is right where I was a moment ago. Oh, no. It's, it's where you were a moment ago. It's over here, dude. Uh, two rocks. Crap. I wish you could zoom in on the map. A uh, okay, three rocks. It's in the middle. So, rock, two rock, three rock. In the middle. Oh, come on. There we go. You find it? I finally pulled out my oh. shovel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. We're starting to accumulate a crowd, dude. I forgot we were, we were live streaming. <laughs> yeah, because we use this as our camera. <sighs> medium, so. yeah, that's right. Thanks for joining us, guys. We are currently in the middle of trying to find this chest and doing a poor job of trying to find it. Look, I'm going to have to go back to the boat and look at this close up. Yeah. Let's try this. Well, while I have a moment and uh, we're trying to dig up this stupid chest, um, I'll let you guys know uh, there is a, we will be posting this whole video 
as it is quite long in the tooth on uh, YouTube. If you just go to YouTube and search for Row 2501, you'll find quite the collection of other videos. There's PUBG, Destiny 2, Battlefield 1, uh, Forza. There's uh, highlights, commentaries, tips, things of that nature. If you are so inclined. I'm going to have to go back to the boat. Yeah, dude. I'll, I'll keep aimlessly digging. I know, dude. According to the map, it should be like right here. When right I go on the faster. island, okay, there should be a path. Oh, that's path nice. here. It's like trying to find a. I think it's right here. Stack of needles, and a pile of needles. I don't know. According to this map, there's like three rocks kind of in a crescent and it's dead in the middle of that and there's like a path leading to the edge so that should be right here that's what i'm saying look i just walked that whole path i think i walked that whole path Super nope. Extra nope. Keep dreaming. I, st I still think we're on the wrong side of the island. Hold on, I think we're up too high. So go downstairs. There's a black uh, chicken there. I still haven't found any cages. Yeah, that's the other thing we're trying to do. We still haven't even met the regular objective we were going for to begin with. Oh, a lightning strike almost hit the boat. Uh, there are skeletons down here, so I, I have... Uh, we're on the wrong side I of the island. I do feel yet. that there might be some down here. It's back up this way a tiny bit. Path, it's uh, most likely right here. Here's a straight path. Here's three rock clusters. Uh, yeah, because I was just down there. Came back up a little bit. So here's path. Here's path start. Oh, crap. And I was wrong. Oh, the other path starts right here. Digging in the wrong place. I'm going to dig up this whole damn island before I find this thing. is too long.
totally lost. Yeah, I'm definitely lost. Although, don't let this fool you people, in real life, I do know how to read a real map and use a real compass. <laughs> sand. Let's try this. All right, here's all the palm trees. Yeah, I'm going to take this pig right back. For this whole time I've been digging no cages. Yeah, I haven't seen a single cage either. I ran all around this island. Okay, flat rock, which is oh, Skelly! Holy crap! He pulled up right in front of me. <laughs> Tried to ambush me. I'm probably gonna have to empty our boat out. So it's raining. Yeah, yeah. Do double check. Yeah, I'm gonna be here for a second, real quick. Yeah, we're here. Yeah, because we would have lost the loot, too. Okay. Try this again. The edge of the island. Breaking out the map. Got to turn around. Yoink. Oh, that's raining pretty quick. Do you need help? Uh, I might. Oh, crap. Something hit me. No idea what it is. I'm sure, it's a scale. Alright. I think I found the actual spot this time. Do we have a leak or something? Uh, where? We should the not boat, have a leak, though. The boat will spring leaks spontaneously in rough, in rough seas. Oh, I fell off. Oh, didn't take damage. That is a broken barrel. A cage? Yep. I would love to find a cage. Oh, dude, the rain stopped. Nice I got it. You. Yeah, the rain stopped. I can get the rest of this water out. Alright. Yeah, dude, check every little inch for, uh... Going down any? Like, it's not okay. rising either. There's probably a leak somewhere. Here, I'll come back. There's the one you patched. You can't go down down any further than this. Is it a glitch? I think it's a glitch, dude. Oh, no, as soon as you came over here, it emptied. The fuck oh, out of here. Your your bucket might be glitched. Are you throwing it's it my overboard? Bucket. Overboard? I, 
Yeah, but don't you can hear the water hit the splash. Well, it'll still splash if you hit the boat. Like if you don't completely throw it. it no, you like... can you can see the arc of the water go and hit the water. Uh, you might have been lagging and not throwing it overboard. Who That's cares? Bullshit. Problem solves. Back to finding a cage, and I'm pretty sure I found where we needed to be. Okay, so here's... No, no, hold on. You've got to be up here. you got to go this way. There's a small one, is there and a big one? That one shouldn't be visible on the map. Oh, hey, ammo. Nice. Yeah, it's just an ammo. I do need one, though. One oh, one. dude, you know what my dumbass didn't realize? That X might be what? under the ground. Well, that's what I was thinking. I was digging out under here, but I couldn't find anything. How the heck? Over here, I was digging all kinds of crap. Oh, cage. All right, where are this person? Nope, was? that's a seat. I'm just seeing cages now. So, apparently you can just aimlessly attack those bodies. I'm going to test a theory. Can you shoot a fire pile? Nope. To make it burst into flames. Oh, hey. No, 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 no. I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, what? Did you figure it I out? I understand. I'm not crouched. I can't you grab this barrel. Team. Never mind. I was going to grab it. that armor. That, well, no, I was going to grab it. I was going to put it on the on the sticks and then blow it up. Oh, right on. Yeah, but watch out. I'm just going to blow it up. Oh, holy crap. That did a ton uh -oh. of damage to uh -oh. me. Oh, I went to pur purgatory. <laughs> uh, uh, you, you died? <laughs> I died. I'm in purgatory right now. <laughs> oh, that's ridiculous. That's awesome. Wow. Well, don't stand close to explosions, people. No, I think I should raise. Damn, seriously, where are the cages? Like, that's the... The two things destroying my brain right now are the lack of cages. So here's the question, where do I end up? Uh, I think you'll spawn back on the boat. Alpha. I believe. I actually really doubt that. Oh, Skelly. No, you're right. Yeah, when you die, uh, basically in in game or on advent, back on your boat, no matter where you died. Whether it's drowning shark on an island. As long as your ship is floating, that's where you'll respawn. Oh, that first chest in no time, and that second chest is whooping our ass. Alright, so check it out. If you want to see my logic thinking. I'm actually just surprised I found that other one. I'm going to go from this way. All right, check it out. Here, look. If you pull up the map, right now, we're standing on uh, uh, EF2. Actually, no. We're standing well, I'm on... going around. I'm, I'm down on G6. No, no, we're standing on, or I'm standing on D3, which means I need to do an about face and go east. Compass. About face, east. Pull my sword, run. Okay, so I'm on F4 now. Yep, definitely at F4. Yeah, you're too low. 
Yeah, I need to go higher, but um, there should be a little cutting opening. Yep, there's this is where we were digging there. earlier. I shit you not, we were digging over here. We we're digging over there. I ran yeah, straight. On it, right? I ran straight east from where I was and landed over here. I gotta go up a little bit actually. I'm on it, dude. I'm I know I'm on it. Cluster of rocks, exploding barrel. Path going the wrong way. We are just over here. Dude, give me two seconds. I'm going to go get the ancient one and see if he can tell me where it is. He read maps for a living. Yeah, I'll be right back. <laughs> Oh gosh, this is some bullshit. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Who is in the R Red Maps forever. So yeah, he's gonna fit he's gonna find this for us. So, let me go back to starting. Ah, uh, you're in the wrong spot. I already tell you. Alright, see that dock? Okay. We're standing right in front of it. Okay. I'm right, right there. I'm right here. Yeah. I need to be right there, right? Yeah. Just turn around. Exactly. Yeah. That's northeast. Yeah. Compass. Northeast. Oh, dude, we're retards. What? It's on the ground. It's not on the elevated portion. It's on the actual ground. So it's in that cave. It's right here. I'm standing on top of it. 
Yeah, there's the path going out. Yeah. Right? Yeah. That's this path. Yeah. Okay. Should be right here. Inside the crest of the rocks. Oh, there's chickens running around. All right, there's one rock, there's two rock, there's three rock. One, two, three. There's a skeleton next to me. These are the enemies of the game. Yeah, I got it. We kept we kept thinking it was on mission, but it's this hold on. Right there. Yeah. Yeah, this is the only hard part actually. Digging for the spot. <laughs> Thanks. Ladies and gentlemen, my father. Dude, he found it within like <laughs> he found us so quickly. I know. He found it like ten I seconds. Like, we were fucking, like we've been wandering around right for now. like almost thirty minutes doing this. Sad right, to say, well, I still haven't dug it up yet. I'm digging all over the place still. If anybody does have helpful hints on how to read the maps in this game a little bit better, feel free to put them in the comments. I hadn't even been watching the stream. Mm -hmm. Alright, maybe I was wrong. This game is testing me. I have the patience to dig every square inch of this island until I find it. Talking to the same person that's got like 400 hours on two characters in Dark Souls, like each. So it's like 800 total hours on Dark Souls. I'll dig this whole thing up. Shit, I don't give a fuck. What I find fascinating is like they, there's no feedback between you and me when it comes to like where your location is at. And... Yeah, it's not like PUBG where you can see the marker or whatever. We just got to like yeah navigate one another to where we need to be. All right, dude, I dug up all kinds of, and still didn't find it. Nor have I found any cages. I think the game's messing with us. Now I wish these sh different shovel types weren't cosmetic. Help me dig up faster. Dude, seriously, you have to come see all the shovel marks that I've put it. I can have a, I'm having a hard time finding you. Um, go. I see you. Yeah, look, dude. I've dug everywhere. Here's the path. According to the map, it should be like right here. And I've already dug like a whole line up and down the path and nothing. Well, see, I think, I think it's further down because I think we're on like E2 right now or F2. Um, no, according to where I ran. I should be standing, you know, in the F grid. I should be standing in the F3. Like, if you want to see how I got here, I'll show you. Follow me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I just, I went to the dock. And then I spun a 360. I, I found spun, it. Oh, hold on. Do not move. I want to see where it was. 
Oh crap, now I lost you. Well, yeah, because the... Was I the, way the off? marker went away. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, you, were, you were very far, right where the stairs are. The, really, the stairs? Go out, go out towards the shore. Go out towards the shore. Hold on, I was right next to the stairs a second ago. Take a right. It was this path? Really? Yeah, this path. Dude, I was off by like... A... Yeah, I was off by a grid square. Good thing you came over here to check my moron, I guess. Alright. Let's get the hell out of here. I was like, I was like, I knew it. it's gotta be somewhere around here. No, we gotta go around the other way, because if we don't, then... So one thing I do apologize for, it's people. Uh, plunder outpost by 3 a.m. on the 12th. Uh, I honestly don't know where to find the calendar in the game to tell you what the day is. Yeah. I'm gonna have to look that up while we're uh, sailing back. I didn't. I, mean, I knew there was a time limit for these things. But we do know there's chickens here, so we can go back to this island and get the chickens. Yeah, but they could like despawn into something. Like it could be something else next time. That's true. But we'll come back Probably here first to test that. Them. Yeah, we'll come back here first to test that theory. Mm. Also, going to look up the cage thing because, dude, we ran literally all over this island. And didn't find one cage. I mean, they seem to be pretty rare. Yeah, but how are you supposed to cage animals then? That's the thing I don't get. I don't know. I mean, we can. The only other thing is like take that cage and try to catch a pig with the senses of a uh, pig cage. Nah, we need to go turn these quests in, dude. Before oh, we yeah, get, definitely. before someone drops us. So, yeah. All right, so let's find out what the nearest outpost is. Yeah, I'm coming. I went and took one last look for a cage like last time. Um, there's the plunder outpost. That's actually where we need to go. Yeah, for the chickens. Oh, that's for the chickens. Huh? Yeah, so we need to go back to... But uh, if that's the closest, let's just fire. go there. I mean, we're right in between both of them. Uh, just find the closest one. Sure. Well, uh, well guys, down. We, we did at least complete one of our objectives. We found all the treasure chests for the message in a bottle. Uh, we're going to go ahead and let you go because this video has gone long in the tooth, like I said. Uh, but it's just going to be a quest turn in, and we've already shown that. But at least we did get to show you, um, you know, a message in a bottle and going for those things. And at the same time, like I said... Uh, all those other chests and stuff. We didn't quite get our merchant quest done, but we served several other purposes at the same time. So hopefully yeah. you enjoyed the video. Um, like I said, if you have any tips about reading the maps or anything that we missed, uh, do let us know in the comments and we'll be sure to uh, correct it in the next video when we do uh, live commentaries or highlights and things like that. Um, hopefully you enjoyed watching. Uh, I'm Bro2501 and this is my uh, PUBG Duo's first person partner. Mr. Wizard, even though his name reads differently, I will it's, always call him Mr. Wizard. Yeah. So, we forecast is the new name. Uh, still go by Mr. Wizard. Uh, if you check out my YouTube, it's the same thing. It's Miserable Wizard. Uh, I have not changed anything over, and I'm probably going to change my name back. So, uh, yeah, look forward to you guys in the future, and uh, have a good night. Uh, so, watch out for other pirates. Did you see all these chests we have down here? Yeah, I know, dude. There's four total. Watch out for pirates, watch out for storms, and uh, may the high seas treat you well. Thanks for watching.